Hi, my name is Buck Bonner and I work for Marine Max in Cumming, Georgia. I'm standing here on the 2019 Taiga R23. I'm going to discuss some of the features that are unique to this boat. Uh, this is a great overall boat, great boat for Lake Lanier. It's got a, a lot of uh, um, interesting features that are you know, very beneficial for you and your family out on the water. Starting at the back of the boat, as you can see, you have your swim platform. It's nice and low to the water. It makes it very easy getting in and out of the boat. Uh, leading straight to your storage compartments here on the transom. Those are great for ropes, ski ropes, uh, gloves, anything that you're using that's small. You have your pop-up ski pylon here. That's great for your slalom skiers or if you're pulling a tube or something. Um, transom stereo control here. These storage compartments also act as nice seats so when you're out on the water and hanging out with your family, people are swimming around, it gives you a nice spot to sit and keep your beverages in your cup holders. Moving into the boat, you have a transom walkthrough so that way you're not having to step on your vinyl as you're boarding um, or getting on and off the boat. You have nice big storage compartments with your plug and play bags on the port and starboard side. As you step down, notice that the synthetic teak is continued throughout the step down, your transition from the transom to the interior of the boat that way you're not stepping on any vinyl this particular boat is one of my favorite color combinations it's the tangerine and graphite uh, definitely pops out on the water and people people see you coming you need lots of storage on these boats you've got flip-up storage uh, all the storage compartments are finished out with synthetic teak you also have your port side lounger that way you can have someone watching your rider um, you also are going to have your rear facing camera that you can access from your clear screen so you can watch your rider from the helm without having to take your eyes off the horizon and look up in a mirror or anything. Um, you're also going to have in the cockpit of this boat a garbage can so you have a good spot to keep all your garbage. You're not having a garbage bag float around. Um, this boat has the M2 tower which is a folding tower, a manually folding tower. It makes it very easy for Putting this boat into a garage or if you're dry stacking it, you're paying by the height. Makes it fit into a lot of places that a, a normal wakeboard boat would not. It also has your M2 wakeboard rack, so it gets the boards out of the interior of the boat, gets them out of the way, as well as you'll have your surf pockets on your bimini for your surfboards. Um, as we move forward, this particular boat has the clear screen, which is a very large screen. All the functionalities of the boat can be controlled from here, from your lighting to your surf settings to your, your rear facing camera even. Um, it's a very functional screen. It's designed to uh, you know, do any function on the boat with just the push of two, two buttons at a time. You also have your smart wheel, which is an upgrade on this boat. The major functionalities of the boat can also be controlled from your steering wheel. Once you get the hang of the steering wheel, it's really easy from muscle memory. You just know what button to hit when. Um, you don't even have to, to look down at it. As you notice, tons of space in this, this cockpit as well. This boat's rated for 16 people. Lots of storage, tons of storage compartments everywhere you look. You also have built-in heaters as well. Built-in heaters, if you're going out for that fall ride, as soon as you get out of the water, you can put your hoodie on, put the heater up under your hoodie and, and stay nice and warm. The R23 does a great job of space here in the bow as well. It's a very deep bow, it's a very long bow, so you can put a bunch of friends and family up here as well. This is a great overall boat for the lake. Um, come see me, Buck Bonner, at Marine Max to take a look at it.